Hey guys, Gunshy Mori here with another video. And as you guys can see, we're at a new place. We're at the new base. I've been working on this off screen. Um, I've been bringing stuff over from Lost Wake. It's over that way. That's the mountain we tamed the Giga on. And well, the main reason I really took this place is mostly because this river right here is a really deep pocket here. I'll fly up and show you. But I've moved over some guys. Um, I hit level 96 here and I crafted up that saddle there for uh, the big boy. So, yeah, we need to... Uh, am I also level 96? I am. Congrats. We're getting closer and closer. Um, I did add in that Titan mod that I reviewed earlier today as well. Um, so that is in the game. Hopefully he does fix the feeding. I don't know if we're going to go for those guys anytime soon. But I do, I mean, I got the Quetzal with the platform. With the platform. I mean, I could. But I don't know. But yeah, anyways, you see this big old pocket here. I figured that'd just be great for breeding water dinos. And then we got over here where we have all the hatchers. I put down four. This was expensive. It kind of chewed into my metal. But thanks to the Indy Forge over at the other base, it shouldn't take long to replenish. Um, but to, today, I think I'm going to go out. I'm going to get me a good beaver. And I'm going to get me a good dodec. And then I'm going to go get me some Gigantopithecus. I think we're going to go start with the Gigantopithecus, actually. Which, that shouldn't be too hard. There were I saw some running around in the woods up here. So I'll see if... Uh, I'll see here on, uh, was it Dino Tracker or whatever, if there's any good ones around. You ain't gonna believe this. It was legit the one I was saw up in the woods was the highest level on the map. So. Let's, let's do this. I got my kibble already. Where? Shit, I left it. I forgot it. Run. There are a lot of Dilophosaurus over that way. Ugh. I'll show you guys around the base here after I get this girl tamed up here real quick. It is a female, by the way. So, what I'm going to need is my regular kibble. Um, I need to throw away the power cables. As you can see, I've been just kind of running the power cables along the ground. And I do got the generator tucked away down in there. So, it is nice. Uh, what are you beating? I saw it. All right, there we go, there we go. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, communications have failed. I'm gonna go in and shove some food up its butt. Dinin, dinin, dinin. Okay. So it only it's only gonna take two pieces here for level fifth, level one fifty. Then we'll clear that. I don't want to piss her off. That's the problem. If you piss them off, you're SOL. So this one also had really good stamina. It had 27 in its stamina. So I'm going to get it tamed up. Oh, God. Hey, look, there's, a, there's another Nerva. I thought I pissed it off. Honestly, clenched. All right, let's get this real quick. That is another one, but it's the dust. I've actually gotten so many of those, like just in this area around the base when I was building it. Cause there's just a couple of them lying around. Okay, going in for shove a berry up your butt. You don't want berries up your butt. Or kibble up your butt. Okay. I'm officially out of crops as well from the stuff I had. Cause I think I have I mean I used what was left of my potatoes and the corn here to make up uh, this sim or was it regular kibble? I got the simple in the other one at the base, but yeah, I'm now out of shit, basically. So I need to get a farm going again. And apparently these apes are really good at the farm as well. They'll basically pick any of the berries and uh, vegetables you got. Or it, they'll pick the vegetables and any narco or stem berries you got. 
Go pet the bat. Okay, okay. I think we should be good. I'm just going to get out of its range where it's no longer pissed. Best way to do that where you don't run it off somewhere dangerous is to fly up. And... Well, boom. Alright, I bet she's hungry, actually, by now. She's got to be hungry. Oh, you're not hungry. This might take a minute. Okay, let's go in for another taste. See if we can give you some berries. Wait, hungry. Why aren't you hungry? She's taking forever. She's really taking her sweet time at getting hungry here. Are you fucking kidding me? Where's the bat? I'm going to drink a fucking potion. I'm... I'm... Nope. Mm-mm. That piss that mm, I'm a murder someone. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. Okay, thank you. I'm <laughs> I'm so pissed. <laughs> Why did you have to do that? Why did you have to show that? <coughs> Why did you... Mutiendes. Why did you fuck? I don't even know what the hell I just said. I probably just, like, pissed a bunch of people off. Uh, but why the hell did you have to? Like, what is eating... Okay, um, I need to work on base defenses. There was a Rex eating my base. Did you take any damage? Uh, a lot of the shit here could have, though. I think actually some of my platform there did. Any of the kitchen hurt? I'm hoping maybe he just came up and started... I don't know. I don't know what he did. Andy was here. Andy looked like he looks like he got bit a bit and pushed. I don't know what the hell just happened. Andy's falling down a cliff. That's what's happening. And here we have our Bigfoot or Sasquatch, whatever you want to call it. Gigantopithecus. Bigfoot options. Okay, those are all the options you get. And then when you have it, you got costume head hands armor all that so you can craft them armor over in a what is it the carrick's better dino workbench in the smithy part um we have one of those back at the other base but i'm gonna quickly get us another two or hopefully another one but it's probably gonna be two because i want to get good health and good melee on these guys as well because i want to have a monkey army so I'm going to see if I can get me one really good one with good health and good melee. Or either one good one with health or one good with melee. But we'll figure that out. Alrighty guys, and we are back. As you can see here, I got a nice one here on the left. This one came out with a nice 45 in its health. This one is the 43 there. As you can see, that's going to be our stamina one. That's our the original one we got. And then we got this nice brown one here that spawned in. And she got a nice 39 in her melee, but her movement speeds up at 42. So hopefully we can get the 26 from this one on. Because what you really want to do here is you want to get all the high stats and all the low stats. So what we want here, for the, we, want the, we want the health, the stamina, and the melee. And then what we really probably want, we probably want the, the high uh, weight, natural weight from you. I ain't going to lie. But we're going to want the low movement speed because... That movement speed does nothing, by the way. And we're also going to want the lower oxygen and the lower food. And the reasons are is just just so that way... Uh, because the more perk points you have on it, the higher its natural level is going to be. So that's why I got a... What is it? 
My terror birds spawn at like 277 something because of the stats I have on them now. And it's just because they have a lot of high stats. In which that's not a good thing or a bad thing. It's a bad thing on uh, normal. Was it normal player or whatever? Because of that. But anyways, I'm going to show you guys around the hatchery here real quick. So as you guys can see, we do got a nanny. This should get us 100% on all dinos no matter what. Um, then we have the hatcher here. This is turned down a bit in my any settings where it's uh, its range is only about 10 and uh, it doesn't do the same, it doesn't give the over raptor thing so that way it's, we're going to have to get over raptors but it doesn't give the over raptor effect anymore um, and it only does 50, it only does like 0.5 but it normally does, it usually does it two times on the hatching speed. I have it set down to a 0.5 on hatching speed for it but that's 0.5 then times our 40 by the way so but as you can see here we actually got these to hatch it i figured as this bit oh my god i thought it was gonna fly off the cliff as this guy's collecting stuff he should be able to and then we'll throw him in here and we'll be able to tell whether or not it's a male female or that and then we won't have a bunch of like excess ones that we have to get rid of but on mammals like these ones here we're gonna probably have to so yeah I really hope that this brown sticks around because we got two like almost pure, pure dark, dark colored ones here and that brown one, that light brown is just nice. So I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to move these guys here. I'm going to start breeding the, these two up first. So we're going to get the stamina, well, we're going to, what, what is it, what are we going to get mixed up together? So what we're going to get here is we're going to get the melee off of you and the health and hopefully the weight off of you okay i had a bug there sorry my game crashed on me okay anyways um behavior here's something hitting just to make sure we don't got anything nearby hitting okay we're good yep, behavior enable mating i don't know how this actually works I had someone tell me you can use like mammals with this, but I don't think you can. So I ain't gonna give it a shot. But here are the cryo fridges. Um, I tried to center them up as best I could, but I just said fuck it <laughs> at that point. So right, let's we're gonna see what this one turns out as, and then we're gonna go out and get us some. Uh, Dodex, because the beavers, there's not many beavers spawning right now. And they're going to start gestating. Okay, now, apparently, if I move this close to it. Okay, yeah, now someone told me that, yeah, I think that's complete bullshit. <laughs> But there we go. These two are breeding. That should take about 10 minutes. I'll wait until this one's born. Then we'll go out for the Dodex. Here it comes. She's actually come quite wide. Okay. Oh, where is it? <laughs> Hello there. Come this way. <laughs> oh my god. I need to... I need to look at this. Look at that. Look at that. What are your stats, little one? Okay. Uh, you got the melee we're looking for. I think you're... Ex you know, you just gain stats from your dad. You get any of the loss. Damn it. Alrighty. Well, looks like you're getting murderized. And it's dark now. So I guess I will just give you guys a tour of what we got. So, again, showed you around the hatchery or the, you know, yeah, breeding area. This is just my uh, S Plus crafting station that I've been storing my stuff in, such as that stuff and uh, all that. I actually haven't got a place to build, a, like, or was it a workshop area yet? I was thinking about doing another one, like the egg area. But I did make a kitchen here, and I kind of wish I did make it open. Um, again, it just got a fridge, uh, another grill, and a cooking pot. 
So yeah, but then we got back in here. This is my this is my place. I got two beds, two storage. Uh, I got a nice little table, so that way people can sit at it, but nobody else is here. So yeah, no no point. We got this place. Figured this would be a nice place to store all my armor. And then we got back in here. This is the toilet. We got a nice little window. And we got the that. Yeah, we got this. I don't know. I can't remember what button it is to poop. So yeah. We ain't gonna do that. But anyways, we do have this nice little path down here. And we got the generator here and this nice little outcove that was on the side. I figured it was just nice and it like made it so that way I could tuck the generator away somewhere where you wouldn't see it, you know. And I think it worked out nice. And um yeah. I'm just wondering on where I'm gonna put up a workshop area. I was wondering maybe over here and like like you know, have it have it so that way the Generator's hidden underneath the workshop area. I kind of build it where the Quetzal is, but I don't know. Over there, I want to do my farm on... Well, not up in there, but down over there on the other side. And what I'm going to do is go over here and right from here. I'm going to build a bridge over. But I did... Was, I was able to work on the Bigfoots here a bit. I did manage to balance them out. They are hatching up here. So, yeah, that's all done. Um, I brought over my cryopods as well. That's mostly all I did. And I, oh yeah, I also did start working on the bridge. Mostly it. So. We are going to go look for some dodecarus. Dodecarus? Dodecarus? Dodecarus, yeah, those guys. So, yeah. But here's a nice aerial view of the base so far. I mean, trying to keep all the guys centralized just for in case there's another like T-Rex attack like there was the other day. Or, or yeah, earlier in the episode, yeah. All that. But as you can see, there's a path here on each side of the river. There's a bunch of paths down here as well, so I don't know what I'm going to do with all that. But... I'm going to try and get over to this and then connect it up to over here to where I'm going to build up all the farms. I'm going to build the egg farms up here up against the riverside here to clean up these rocks. But yeah, until then. Oh, that's a nice looking one. I want to look at you. I still have all my cryopods on me. Oh. You're a nice cut. You got, you got nice colors. Got nice colors. But anyways, I'm gonna go find a nice dodecarus. I found another giga. Ooh, please be a good one. Please be a nope. Oh. Well, um. You are on the list. You are on the list. A 90 is not bad compared to all the other ones that we've seen, but I want to steer clear of that. Um. <clears throat> Good Dodecarus around here. I'm gonna go up here, land, and go actually see exactly where that 145 was. Because there was one, I think it died, because that's the one I was tracking. And, uh, see what happened to it. Okay, uh, where is she? Oh. Oh shit, she's right there. I feel like I'm stupid for not noticing it. Where the fuck's that Giga? I think it's down the mountain more. There it is. See it? Fuck. I don't like the fact I can see it. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna get this Dodecarus knocked out. Um, did I bring the Trank Gun? It did, and I did also remember all my darts. Okay. Let's do this the smart way. My way would be get her into a trap. Stupid way. Would be this. Uh, okay. Now I think I let her know something is trying to put her in danger. She missed me. 
think. Oh no, dear God, no. She's still going down the mountain. <laughs> Did you stop? No, you didn't stop. You need- No! No! <laughs> no! Oh, okay. We got one chance. We got one chance. We got one opportunity. There goes that opportunity. Okay. Go out. Yeah, it needed just one. Okay. Now. I'm gonna do something stupid. Let's piss it off at the. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. I'm going to let you. No, no, where are you going? No, it's going after the dodec. No. Here, I'm gonna pull up the dodecris and see how it's doing. Touch the sharp end. Touch the sharp end. Ow, ow, ow. Quit tarp. I touched the sharp end a couple times, guys. I think it's best if the sharp end stays down there. That Giga was a stupid idea to fuck with. I didn't, like, oh, the bat hurt. The bats hurt so much. So much. You really are stupid. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna get this girl tamed up and then we're gonna get home. Okay, I'm back. So I got all three of my Dodex now. I got one for each of the stats I needed. Um. Basically, you know what, in this cryo fridge right here, I'm going to throw all the ones that need to be refined into, so let's quickly get that sorted. Okay, here we go, I got it sorted. Are you guys okay? Why are you bloody? Yeah, you got, hold up, let me check my feet and drop. I'm pretty sure it's got food. Also, I hope you guys like the lighting. I did a little bit of a thing there on the bridge, so that way it's lit up, glows across. Um, I'm really thinking about putting a workshop right there and maybe a... You know, maybe a, you know, a railing right here and putting the light up on it as well. But they're good in there. I really do need to get them more berries, though. But they're good. They're doing good. Um, other than that, let's get back to it again. So these are the ones that we all have done, or that I'm 100% sure. Um, there is a little bit of a difference in the color there. But I'm not too biggy, because look, the stats are exactly the same. I mean, I don't, I really don't know what else I could do. Same with these. Stats are exactly the same. I think that's all we're really worried about. There's no mutations, no nothing. It's just randomized by the parents. Just like the stats. It's the one that we got lucky with. Um, I'm pretty sure... Yeah, it should be fine. As long as the stats aren't messed up, we should be able to tell. Those should be good genetic copies. So these are the done ones. These are the unfinished. So these are all the ones that we have just cryopotted up and waiting. I tried to get them organized. So we got the Deodons up here, the Raptors. I'm definitely going to try and finish off the Raptors here soon. I'll do that here in a minute. Um, 
We got otters still to do. Did we get the otters? No, we didn't get done with the otters yet. They're still needing refined. What is being attacked? There's another female de dodec out there I've been thinking about going and getting. But I'm not too sure. That one's in the Arctic. Be chilly. Really chilly. I don't really feel like it, so. Here, I'll just quickly. There we go. We got your kind. Also, we're looking up casters. There's a 150 in the in the lake over at Lost Island. Or not Lost Island. At Lost Lake. There's one over there. There's a level 50 just chilling in the lake. The last time I was there and I got the cryos, there were two lo there were two alpha raptors outside by that lake. So I don't know if they they might have noped out because the bracky killed them or something. I don't know. But I'm gonna wait for day here. Um, I'm not going to brood up the Dodex. I don't think they lay eggs. I think they're pregnancies again, aren't they? Yeah. But, yeah. I don't know. I'll figure out something. But well, actually, once these guys are done, I'm going to breed them together once. Raise that baby, get a 100% imprint. And it's going to be my new fiber getter. Same thing with the Dodex. So I do need to refine the Dodex. Because these guys stone and wood they're gonna go back to lost lake there because they belong there they're they were i got them there they're lost lakes tools they're for where when we do their construction over there at lost lake we'll get one we'll get we'll get some other ones here i'm sorry guys but i know it's a nice bait you know what no we're gonna give you guys a retirement home fuck it you know what that's probably what we'll do down here give our dinosaurs <laughs> I don't want to fall down there when it's dark and I just scare the shit out of myself. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah. We'll give our dinosaurs a retirement home or send them back, back to Lost Lake. I don't know. I almost said walk again. What the fuck was that? Did you guys make a noise? I could have sworn I heard like some go blah 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 blah. Like, like what the hell was that? I heard it again. I think it's these guys. I think they talk. I don't know. I don't trust you, you monkey folk. I, I, I shouldn't say that. That could be taken the wrong way. Holy shit. Holy shite. Don't want to say anything like that. Ooh. That was a close call. Yeah. Not those guys. Yeah. Now, I think we're going to go get the Castros in the morning here, and then we're going to call it. Because, I mean, I've had a long day. I legit had to go to work here in the middle of this video. In between the Gigantopithecus and those guys. Luckily I was able to work on the Gigantopithecus on my laptop. I was just breeding them up. Ooh, look, I found some ghost ants. Might. Well, I should probably see if those guys are tameable. I don't know. They might be able to. I don't know. I'd have to look. Alrighty, guys. Here we are. We got the Castorotus here. As you see, there's a bit of a population here. Now, I don't want to wipe out the Castorotus population here at Lost Lake. Ooh, 145. It's at 145. Eh, wouldn't be too bad for health. But we're going to grab that 150. That's what we came here for. I don't know what happened to all the alpha, alpha raptors. I could have sworn there were some around here. But you know what are safe places to tame up some dinos? Oh, in your own base. Behind safe. Guarded walls. Oh, you guys, you're fast. You broke my foot. 
black. Oh shit. Did I uh Oh he's out. We good. Alright, again, here's the drill. We're gonna let him starve up. I'm gonna go find uh, the other one. I'm gonna just go see if I can get a good mail. You know? Ain't worried too much. Just wanna have good stamina, that's why I wanted it. I mean, I worried about too much on damage on the Castrotas, but some health would be nice. Maybe some weight. And here we go. Cryoing up the last Castrotas here. Got a nice mail. So that should be the last one we need. And now, I honestly don't know what else we need for the base. I think we just need an Anki, but we'll get those next episode. I'm gonna give the base one last flyover. This might be the last time we ever actually come back to it. I don't know. I mean, all the eggs. We have to make a dodo farm, definitely. As you can see, I mostly cleaned it out. Only thing left here is this stuff, all this junk. Stuff I'm not using. There's a bunch of resources still here, actually, as well. I almost forgot about all these. You know what? I can take these with me right now. Here, let me, uh, I almost forgot all my tools and shit. Damn it. I almost forgot. I, that would have been so bad. I just realized that when I was looking through. I'm so glad I came back to look. Let me grab all the tools. I am going to leave some stuff. Like the old broken flak armor. I mean, I don't need you. I don't need you. I don't need... Titan. I mean, that's... Sh don't need you. I need that. Definitely need that. Need the... That. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need any... Of you. I'm gonna just start throwing stuff out. Uh, I think that should be good. I need to drink some water. Get one last drink from the faucet. We are pretty over encumbered here. I don't know how well the bat's going to fly. Yeah, he's near max as well. We're a little chubby. And we are home again. Uh, let's just go throw you guys in with the, the lot. You guys got transferred over into a lot. Um, let's get the Gigantopithecus here stored away. And then we'll go put away what's left of these cryopods. Alright, one more, one more, one more. Okay. Oh, okay, shit. I'm getting tired here. I'm dozing off. Sorry. I really. It's been solid 12 hours. Well, 12 hours since, yeah. Then two hours since I got back taming up the Castorotis. And the Dodeck. Well, yeah, I know. Probably closer to three now. Yeah, no, it's closer to three. But, yeah. Anyways, that should be it. And this is the. No, you're the creatures. You're the empties. So glad I remember to grab all the stuff I left there. Um, I forgot some stuff. I know I forgot some stuff. Shit. I have to head back. I'll head back there again. Off screen and go double check. Make sure I didn't leave anything. Here's all our good saddles. And yeah. That's basically it for this episode. I'm tired. I'm exhausted. Uh, I, I mean, I had I I bred a mammal today. The mammals are going to be the hardest thing to breed up the perfect pairs for, just because mammals I can't throw a uh, lay egg. I must take pick them up and then throw them here so I can see what gender they are and crack them. You know. But anyways, 
You guys know the drill. I don't got any pants. But this has been Gunshot Mori. If you guys like what you saw, there is a complete playlist for you to watch. It is linked in the description along with a link to the mod list collection. Uh, yep, there's a collection now. I have not updated the any file yet. I will do that here when they are finalized. Um, but feel free to do what you want with them. Set up what you want. Set up what creatures you want. But anyways, again, this has been a fun time. And if you guys like ARC, please do leave a like and subscribe. Ring that bell so you get notifications of when I do post. I've been trying to post here on the daily. And anyways, this has been Gun Chai Mori, signing off. Peace.